Okay, this is going to be a real quick video just to show how easily we can set up for and use the rotary adapter. Once everything's been initially aligned, as I as I demonstrated in an earlier video and, and in a in a review of the rotary adapter, but this is all about how do you use it on a day-to-day -day basis, uh, how quickly and easily you can do it. So, first thing I want to do is get the head back out of the way, and I need to run the adapter down, or run the table down a ways so that we'll get it out of the way. Okay. And then the removable tabletop comes in and out very easily. Once it's out, all I have to do is set the rotary adapter in. And one thing that I'm going to have to make sure I do before I swap the wiring with the y-axis is make sure that my the head is directly over the center line. You may recall from reading the article earlier that I set the center line at exactly 100 millimeters from the back of the table and that way I can easily find where it goes. So first thing I'm going to do is come over and get about where I'm going to be for the um, the x-axis and I'm going to set this, set the DSP and tell it to run exactly 100 millimeters, which it did. And now I can go ahead and swap the motors. We're going to connect the rotary adapter motor. Okay, that's in there. I'm going to go ahead and just put in a, a small, uh, small piece. Of, this is one I've already done some work on before. So I want to make sure that uh, I, it's just a, a scrap at this point. One of the things I have to do is check my height. And you can see that my height is still a little bit high right now. So let's run that down just a little bit more. That's about it. And I'm going to change my position on the x-axis just a little bit for where it's going to go. Yeah, that's good enough. I'm set my origin. And I've already downloaded the project, so I'm just going to tell it to go ahead and go. And yes, I am going to run it with the window, with the door open so you can see. But I got interrupted there. We're actually having a thunderstorm at the moment and something was uh, banging against the door. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and tell it to run. And as I was starting to say, you we're doing it with the door open so you can see, but yes, I do have uh, safety goggles on. And we'll see if we can zoom in a little bit on that. You can see it's doing a real nice job on the glass. And we got just a little bit more to go. Just finishing up. Then we'll pull it out and you can see that it did do a very nice job.
And the nice part is it was uh, it was very easy to do. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pull the power to the um, to the motor. Pop that out. Slip my table back in. And I need just a little bit more room, so let me make sure I've got my Y back on. Move the head out of the way. Table's back in place. And we'll kind of run it back up to uh, close to where it would be, depending on what the next material is that I use. So you can see that using the rotary adapter really only takes about a minute to set up and uh, about 30 seconds to tear down and you're back in business with something else. So doesn't, don't hesitate to, to get the rotary adapter, get it all set up for yourself and I think you're going to find it works really nicely for you. That's all.